Hey guys, what's up? Says Maris here, and today I'm showing you guys how to correctly fix the Minecraft black screen or Minecraft crash. This will this will work for Minecraft version 1.0 to Minecraft Alpha. Anything with a Minecraft folder, this should work. Now it's important to note that the main problem of a Minecraft crash is the use of mods. People incorrectly install mods, and it does not work with the original Minecraft folder, thus creating a problem and crashing Minecraft. Now. Just to show you guys that my, my Minecraft does not work. Put it up here. Log in. Okay, so we get the, past the black screen, but again, here, and it will freeze. So, although not entirely a black screen because it's white, it is a freeze and there is a problem with it. So, what we're going to do first is we're going to open our Minecraft folder by going to Library, Application Support, Minecraft. This is for the Mac only. I believe for the PC you have to go to app data, search Minecraft, and it will work. Uh, open up your bin folder, Minecraft.jar, and you want to make sure the meta.inf folder, which is very important to delete if you're using mods or pretty much anything for that matter. Uh, this folder is completely useless. So even if you don't have any mod, mods installed, just get rid of that folder and then open up Minecraft again and see if it works. Now we're back here again. And doesn't look like we're gonna get anywhere. Is it gonna freeze again? I do believe. Yep, it has. It, it Minecraft has crashed. Now, if that did work for you, uh, congrats, and you can go freely play Minecraft. However, if it didn't, like me, then we have to do something extra. Now, there are several patches or patcher programs you can use, but those can be highly ineffective and they just don't work. So. The only thing that's very important when or what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to completely reinstall Minecraft again from the very beginning. Now it's important when we do this to save all useful information. So if you want to save your texture packs or your I don't know, your mods or something, then go ahead and do that. But I recommend, and this is highly recommended if you want to uh, do this properly, only copy or move your saves folder out of your Minecraft and somewhere more secure. Right now I'm just moving to my desktop. Anything else like your texture packs, I do not have any installed. Your stats is just like your achievements and how many times you've mined a block. Uh, texture packs can create problems as well. Resources, just sound. Pretty much everything else in here is completely useless. The only thing that matters is your saves and everything you have in there is pretty much what you need for Minecraft. So what we're going to do now is we're going to Actually, I'll just show you something else. Uh, if you do want to keep all this info, all you have to do is get rid of your bin folder, as such, and go back to Minecraft. Log in. And it will reinstall the bin folder for Minecraft. As you see, it's going. Uh, this will take place, and we switch back to this window. As you see, the bin folder is being reinstalled. Now, if there's a problem with the bin folder uh, of your Minecraft uh, folder or of your Minecraft, then this just simply getting rid of the Minecraft or just simply getting rid of the bin folder will work. However, if it does not work, uh, you're going to have to completely reinstall Minecraft again by deleting the entire folder. This can also be done by just simply pressing uh, update and that will happen. So let's wait for the minecraft.jar file to completely uh, re-update. Okay, so we're back in and is it gonna work? Yes it does, so we've correctly fixed this problem. Uh, now I'll show you guys what to do if minecraft does not work and it is still not the bins folder or not the bins problem what you're gonna do is you're gonna open minecraft again you're gonna go to options and you're gonna force update done what, what this means is when you log in again it should update your minecraft and again hopefully fix the problem if there is one this is again to pretty much fix your bin folder and if this does not work, then we're going to have to resort to the last option, which is completely deleting Minecraft.
Okay, so Minecraft is back open, and this should work. If it, yep. Okay, so if this again did not work for you, then you're gonna have to resort to more drastic measures. Again, make sure you have your saves folder, your very important folder, which has all your worlds, onto a separate area, which will not be deleted, such as your desktop. Now, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your Minecraft folder and just delete it, just completely get rid of it, and now it's gone. So, pretty much what that means is that anything in that folder, which was surrounding the problem is completely gone. What we're going to do now, just reopen Minecraft and you're going to have to completely enter your information again. Now this shouldn't be a problem, very simple and unfortunately Mojang has not yet got to the point where you can keep your saves online so you're not going to be able to, that's the important thing for keeping your uh, saves folder to the side. So we're going to let Minecraft update Okay, so once Minecraft is done, as you'll see, it'll come back up, and it works. So, now that Minecraft works, what you're going to do is you're going to go back into your Minecraft folder, and as you see, it has the bare essentials. It has no mods, no extra folders. This is just, this is it. This is Minecraft. What you're going to do is just drag your save folder, which you move to a permanent place, back in here, replace it, and you will have all your saves back in Minecraft. So when you open... When you open the uh, when you open Minecraft up again, log back in, and we go to the single player world, and we have all of the saves. So that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, again, there's three ways you can do it. This involves uh, deleting the meta.inf file, uh, getting rid of the bin folder either by update or completely putting it in the trash and then finally erasing your Minecraft folder. If none of these work, please leave a comment and I will get around to helping you as fast as soon as possible. I had this problem myself for a while and it really irritated me and pretty much no one could help so I had to solve it by myself. So if there is a problem guys, please let me know and I, am, I would be more than glad to help you. Uh, please leave a comment, leave a like, and I will see you guys later.